All right, we started having problems with some outlets just stopping working in this mobile home. And uh, so I started taking apart some of the outlets and uh, replacing them with, uh, you know, regular normal home ones. Now, I really do recommend you getting a licensed electrician to do this, but I just want to show you how these things work. Okay, here's the outlet. It's got these two little tabs that pop out to catch a sheetrock. But here's the part I do not like. Pop this cover off. See how it's just shoved into those blades? They just go around the insulation. Here's your wire. It just goes around the insulation and pierces the sides. It's very bad connection sometimes. And uh, most of the time you can just pull it right out. Like that. Now you see? That was the connection it had. That's it. So, let me go ahead and uh, prep all this stuff. And uh, we'll go from there. Alright, here's a new um, receptacle box I put in versus this one piece thing. Um, new outlet is connected. Uh, black to the gold. White to white. The bare wire goes to that green right there. I like to leave these things loose until after I get it all hooked up. Um, because these little tabs are not very strong. And uh, a lot of times you can just pull the... Uh, You'll pull through the sheetrock. Go. Now I did cut this hole out just a little bit bigger, but it might be a little tight. We shall see. Might be a little bit too tight. Oh, there it goes. These little tabs have a tendency of getting in the way. There we go. It's going to be behind that little stop right there. It's a little too tight, but it'll work. Alright. You tighten up that little thing. go all right now all we gotta do is uh test it out yeah. Alrighty, got my little tester here and uh works just as good as a, a meter um tell me everything's good my ground my neutral's good and uh um my power wire is not reversed or anything so there you go pretty simple just need to put the cover back on it